Oh, no, I was just saying, it's like, even though that's only had like, I think like 87% or something like that, I believe see. some people told me that rage starts as low as 50, so like, there was still... That's like the start bit. of his rage, you know, like... Yeah, so it kind of helped out with that, um... And that already stopping. being, I think, a 100% light character killer. Yep. Oh, that was the match. Yeah, that was actually, uh, the set right there. Oh, I didn't, I didn't realize that. Yep, two one. Said, jumped in late. So next up right here we have uh, TMO4 decided to switch to the Bumblebee outfit, decided to try his luck with a different track outfit, <laughs> and then we have uh, BZ. He's done uh, he's done pretty well against BZ actually before this matchup. Oh, has he actually? Mm -hmm. Not, you know, not insane. He's never just schooling him or anything like that, but gotcha. I see him take stocks and I see him take uh, take games. I don't think he's ever beaten him in a match. Ah, uh, I see. You know. Oh, and drop yes, the foot. Oh, and just nice that. weight on that. But yep. he's still not dead, actually. Good DI on that. Yeah, oh, I'm so, it's always hard kill. for me to actually tell with a DI for Luigi, though, know, because, like, mm -hmm. for the Mario Bros., like, it has the same attack, but, like, you have to DI in a certain way. Mm -hmm. with, with ice. That's oh, still not killing. Not even with the oh. grab and, like, back throw at the end of the ledge. Mm -hmm. well, that's going to seal it, though. Tennis, yeah, just where you get hit off the top of that head. You know, coming in determines where you go, and so you can be holding, you know, this way, thinking you're gonna go that way, and then it it throws you the way you weren't expecting, and you're just dying into the throw. Ah, oh, crap. Yep. Right. So, way to get one in there. He knew BZ wasn't gonna let him actually have it, but he caught BZ looking, and that's how they get the next little points in. True. Oh, well, yeah, BZ's definitely trying to see if he can finish this uh, match as quick as possible. Oh, yeah. So I'll say only like 34% on the spike. Right there. Oh. oh! Oh, good tech there. Yeah. And good job on TM4 for getting that that thunder in. Uh, but it looks like, I guess BZ can't get that, well, for what the community calls it, freshman four year or whatever. It's nice that BZ's not like, you know, being afraid to go out there and challenge. Uh, that mm. should be the stock. But yeah, it's like, it's nice that BZ's not go, being afraid to go like, out there and challenge. Uh, that's his upbeat. It's like, a lot of people are, uh, Hesitant to uh, really go out there for it. Yeah, it's like so. Like they think it's like yeah, I'll just let them come back to the ledge. But like the thing that I've heard like some top players say is that um, whenever he's about to start up his up B, like the moment that you see like him dipping down to try yeah, to get an angle, that's mm -hmm. when you decide to actually go down there and, and to it. you know attack him or something like that. Okay, because yeah, if, like uh, who did he play earlier? Someone was playing a Ness, I can't remember who exactly it was, and they went out and just hit him with a, a neutral air right after he started, and it was just nothing. The thunders kept waving on, and there's nothing he could do, you know? It's yeah. just simple of games sometimes, but... Yeah, just always be prepared, just like, though, that, okay, so afterwards, I have to make sure that I have to attack this. Mm-hmm, oh, yeah. Because, um, in case, like, you do whip or something like that, Oh, that would have yeah. definitely been like an early <laughs> stop there if he got that up. Yeah, that was under there. It's like that. I was a little afraid right there. That was beautiful though, dodging it outside of frame and everything. I was just not letting go. Ooh. So weird choice on that uh, that drill kick. Let's just go for the back here and keep it going. Yeah, not yet. Not in these wide stages. I said tornadoes. To some damage there. I was about to say not, he's noticing that like uh, back throw wasn't going to kill, so he decided to go. He decided to actually just rack up some damage enough throw, just get back some stage presence. Mm -hmm. It's like that should have been stuck right there after mm -hmm. getting a little bit more percentage. The first stock. Well, that that was a nice little stare down that they had right yeah. there. Just stop. It was like <laughs> I know you want to actually you know attack me, but <laughs> I got a sensibility. So. Yeah. Can we try something here. Oh, oh, and faked him out. <laughs> that was that was well. Now, if he would have teched that off the side, would he get another PK Thunder? Yep. Okay. Like, I, I think he was still trying to come to the ledge, but it's possible to, um, if you hit the side of the stage with uh, PK two, what happens is that you're able to actually get another PK Thunder off. Really? Yep. It works with both Destin and Lucas, and that's something they added in this game. That's that's pretty fresh. Yep. Ooh. Like he's done. Like we played him. Uh, or lie a few times, so he's done that before. Uh, sure. TM4 or... Huh? TM4? Yeah. Not sure how much violence he's giving off of, uh... He can get off of these, uh... Flashes? Yeah, PK Flash, Edge Guard. So like, I think it'd be better to actually, you know, go out there and attack him or use... Oh! I thought uh. he was about to rock himself off for a second. It's like, <laughs> but yeah, using the, uh... Up... 
use of the PK Thunders to actually uh, scale out there. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh what, what did it hit him with? Duck. It was like up air, but like it was delayed because of the duck. The duck, okay. So like his counter pick actually coming through right there yeah. for him. <laughs> and uh, with Ness, is, I, I think Ness actually has a really good aerial game. Um, you know, I think it's probably a little bit faster than Luigi's, maybe not as many kills in the same spots. Mm -hmm. You know, same exact attacks, but just going out and throwing out your forward, it comes out in front of you, the disjointed hitbox, it's a little safe, you know, so... Yeah, like it's, that, def it's definitely hard to, you know, challenge him when he's doing something like that. Mm -hmm. Let's see. So using that as a, a ledge guard, not letting them get back, and, you know, like you're saying, not being afraid to go off the ledge a little bit, and... Ooh, there you go. Or the DI, I knew where he was going. Yep, so game three here, actually going to be on Battlefield. Beezy's choice right here. Now the stage, both, favors both characters, I think kind of more Ness. It's like, any time that I face a Beezy, it's like, because since I play as Yoshi, he's an aerial-based character. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like FD is obviously the better pick for, uh, you know, Luigi players. Because the fact that, like, it for... Yoshi's such aerial base, like he always comes mm -hmm. to you from the air and stuff like that. You don't really want to challenge him on these platforms where you can just reset all of his you know, air moves and get these combo strings off of you just by hitting right. the platform, jumping up, hit the next platform. Oh, right. It oh, was like with those there. platforms, it's like being able to land safely and stuff like that. So I feel like this is for me, you know, choice that I'd see. That's actually choosy, but we'll see how how it actually pay off for him. He got the see. lead back right there, so oh yeah, see, so I, of course, do it all right. I think it does favor both characters, just with both of them having strong aerial presence. But I think in this matchup, I'd actually go, uh, I'd say Luigi on this one, just only for the fact that uh, a lot of Ness's startups and stuff. Oh, I I thought it was gonna kill it first, and then with a the slight delay, I was I was hoping not. I got you. But, but, uh, you're saying. Yeah, a lot of his startups and stuff are projectiles. And so, just having that, I mean, you know, Luigi has the one as well, but you can really use the platforms, I think, against most projectile characters to, you know, stop anything they want to start up, or like, you know, have it hit the, have it hit the platform, hide under or above them, and just wait on the other layer and let them throw the move and then come and get them. And with Luigi, <coughs> after the, you know, after that setup, he, like you said before, he also sort of favors these platforms, so... Say he throws a PK fire, you know, whiffs and it's sitting in the air a little bit. You just come in, pop him up with a neutral air, and then just chop, chop, back air, or, you know. Right. Get something started there. So I think it's a. I want to say it's a pretty even matchup, in my in my opinion. I got you, man. Who's, uh, who's, was this actually BC's pick? Yeah, this was uh, BC's pick. That's right, because he lost the last one. We were way to wait for it there. I think Ness is going to try to go for the grab and. What I'm looking. Yeah, I was about to say, I, this kind of percentage is like, well, I'm kind of expecting. Oh, yeah. That's, like, that's definitely that's definitely something that TM4 has always been used a lot with um, Liver Beasy throwing uh, fireballs fire on balls. stages. Like, he's using the, the back hit to actually absorb them, get a little bit of percentage back, so it's making it harder for um, a Beasy to Come out there you know, and get punish these, him. Like... Yeah, it's like to get these. Uh, Appropriate kills. Mm -hmm. That's what I say because like he's always constantly recovering you know, his percentage. Oh, I say it's not, it's not a terrible amount, but ooh, there you go. That's what I say it's enough to like you know irritate whoever you're playing with and, the time. You know sometimes that that two points, five points can really make a difference. And I'd say Battlefield's been saving here. Nice dodge. Oh, yeah. Well, now that you think about it, it's like, I probably wouldn't say that's where I want to go here, but, uh... Oh, oh. he lost, uh... I was surprised that he still had this jump. But it was like, now that you think about it from this stage, it probably would favor a lot more Luigi, but I'm thinking it more of, uh, Dreamland. Mm-hmm. Because of the fact that, like, you know, lower ceiling for kills yep. like that, and also, um... 